Patrick and Emma. Today on our show we have world famous Jean Batten. She just got back from her amazing trip from England to New Zealand. Welcome Jean Batten. It's lovely to be here. How long was your trip? 11 days and 45 minutes. Wow, that is a very long time. What if you needed to go toilet? I bought a toilet in my seat just in case I needed to go. That's very innovative. Congratulations again on your successful flight. Tell us a little about how you got interested in flying. I had a flight as a child with famous pilot Charles Kingford Smith. I learned how to fly in England. I got my private flying license in December 1930. Did you find it easy or hard to learn to fly? I had a lot of support from my mum but not much from my dad. Let's talk to them about that. We have them here in the studio. Welcome, Jeans Batten's mum and dad. Hello. Hi there, nice to meet you. Mr Batten, you must be very proud of your daughter. How come you weren't very supportive? A woman's place is not in the air. They should be helping out their family. How rude. Girls can do anything that boys can do, and I am very proud of Jean's achievement. Thanks, Mum. Back to you, Jean. Did you have any problems in your quest to breaking your flying records? I actually did. I had to fundraise a lot of money, especially to buy my two planes, Gip Gypsy Moth and Personal Girl. How did you raise the money? A lot of men who wanted to marry me gave me the money when I took the money and then said no thanks to the marriage proposal. What other achievements are you proud of? Two years ago, in 1934, I flew from England to Australia. In 14 days, 22 hours and 30 minutes, I broke the woman's record for flying from England to Australia. Wow, that is great. Anything else? Last year, I flew from England to Brazil and... 61 hours and 15 minutes. You set the record for the first woman to make this flight. Yes, I did, and it was also the fastest flight across the South Atlantic Ocean. What part of being an achiever do you think you are? The different parts are active, confident, holistic. Innovative. Excel, valued, e-learner and responsible. I think I am confident because it took a lot of bravery to be the first woman to make all these flights. I had to believe in myself. I excelled because I tried my best and had a lot of achievements. I was innovative because I built a toilet and found lots of different ways to fundraise. Lastly, I was responsible because I used the plane sensibly and worked hard to learn what I needed to learn to become a pilot. Thank you so much for coming, Jean Batten. Once again, congratulations on all of your achievements. You have made New Zealand proud. Our next song is Summertime by Billy Holiday. <laughs> Summertime. 